Hey, cats and kittens, chicks and chickens, it's your buddy Corgi Captain 51, also known as Mo Like It, bringing you some Corgi fun. These are these are some highlights, in my opinion, the things, a few moments that I really enjoyed as during my time as a Corgi Captain. I was very lucky to be chosen, and there was nothing better than being able to play any ship I wanted to in the entire game with a 19-point captain, loads of free XP, loads of free doubloons, tons of flags, signals, anything I wanted to do, I could do it. And it was just a blast. It was good for the community, and it was fun for everyone. Now I'm here in my Mogami, and you can see, look at the top right corner, I have not fired a shot. Look at my health, I'm dead. I've got nothing. I've been just absolutely lambasted. The life of a corgi, right? The life of a corgi. I know I'm dead any second, so what am I going to do? I'm going to throw off some torps as I catch a torp from the uh, Pan-Asian guy there and give him a corgi prize that he has earned. But you know what? Those, those, tor those fishes are in the water. I wonder what's going to happen with them. Hmm. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Woo! Flesh wound dev strike. Zero damage. Not a single fire. Not a single shot fired. And I get a dev strike. Flesh wound with torpedoes. Oh, God, it's so lovely. I love stupid shit like that. I'm in my hipper here, and I put the permanent camo on the hipper. Looks pretty good, right? Well, you know, you got tons of doubloons. Why not? I'm pushing into B cap, trying to get a, a DD out of here, and trying to uh, just do what I can for the team, but with all these battleships, I figure I'm pretty much screwed. But then I'm like, oh, well, I'm a hipper. I've got good nose armor. Yeah. That didn't work. We got an almost dead DD, and I want to shoot him so bad, but by the time my turrets turn over for him... It's, it's not, I mean, I'll be dead anyway. So I just kind of focus on maybe getting some torps on this Missouri. Firing off those double racks of six kilometer torpedoes. I'm hoping my secondaries finish off that DD. But of course it was not meant to be. I've got another big hit from a battleship there. I mean, I am so screwed. So I'm hoping these torpedoes start hitting. They do. I get some torp hits. And look at my health. I mean, I'm burning. I got to pop my repair. I got to stop that burning. I am, I'm dead. I'm at nothing. What's left? What's left but to kiss this guy right on his nose? Let's just give him a kiss. <laughs> Ram kill. <laughs> you earned your prize, brother. Enjoy those doubloons, those flags, that container. It's all yours because I gave you a little corgi kiss right on the flippin' nose. <laughs> oh, God, I'm here in my York. I played a lot of cruisers. You guys know I like to play cruisers. So, of course, that's what I played. And uh, nothing, you know, I figured that was the fairest way to do it. Even though I am a, a, a cruiser main, um, I can be deleted pretty easily. I can take some big hits, and somebody's going to get some kills on me. And I gave out a fair amount of prizes, but I didn't give them away easy. On two brothers here, we got two DDs. You see the first one there, but there's the second one. Two almost full health DDs. It's just me. We've got to defend this cap. We've got to do something, because you can see we are triple capped in this game. My, my big thing as a Corgi is I didn't want to just give away free kills and hinder my team. I wanted to still play the game as best I could for my team when I could. I send the torpedoes into the smoke, but unfortunately he did not stay in his smoke. He's got me dead to rights, point blank. Quickly get off some torpedoes at him. Hope for the best. Here comes his torpedoes. I know I'm screwed. Let me get one of these guys. Just one. Oh, oh. <laughs> Woo! Double strike! Both DDs dead. My team easily came back from this and we won this game. Huge, huge moment. But here we go, guys. This is it. This is the stupidest shipping game. This is the Awaki Alpha, the uh, prize ship or reward ship for being an alpha tester something I wasn't lucky enough to be a part of because if I had this ship in port it would not stay there long. 
you know, I played this game, I played this ship like two games before I even realized that it had smoke. I wasn't even paying attention because I was so excited to be a Corgi and play all kinds of ships. So you give a tier four cruiser smoke and insanely accurate guns. It's got that type zero, um, main battery mod whatever the same thing that Katori and the Yubari enjoy which allows you to, to your accuracy to just be stupid just stupid accuracy and you give up a little bit of turret traverse or something for it I don't remember but you know what who cares the ship is deadly deadly accurate and I had a great fun game as you can see I take out that St. Louis for my first kill of the game as I run away from the focus fire. But we're not going to run forever, guys, because we have smoke. So I'm going to push back up into these ships. I'm going to pop that smoke. <laughs> this ship's so stupid. And with the help of uh, friendly teammates easily spotting these guys, I'm just going to lay into this Ichizuchi. This Ichizuchi is just giving me a beautiful target. Look at the accuracy. Look at that accuracy. Just, just, just sinking three pointers from frickin' corner all day. Just, just dropping bombs down on him. Look at that. Look at that. Every single shell is going to about the exact same point. We got him burning. We're just laying into him. We want to finish him off. We want to finish him off. We want some more kills. We want to work hard for our team. We are down a ship. And we are uh, down a lot of points, if you can see. And bam, we get the kill. Yes. That's two kills, guys. All right. Well, we got a DD up the middle here. I'm going to try to take a shot at him if I can get my turrets to turn over there. Um, that's probably going to be my best shot. I don't have a great shot at anything else. Uh, yeah, I don't think I'm going to hit this guy. Nope, but God, look at the dispersion. Look at that tight little freaking grouping. Well, my smoke is almost up anyway, so I might as well get on out of here. Might as well get on out of here and continue to send some shots downrange. We've got another St. Louis that's low on health. We need to get these kills. We need to get this score going up. We, we, we got to come back from this, and we're going to come back from this because this was one hell of a game just one hell of a game such a fun game to play sometimes these little tier four games these low tier games just turn out to be something special now this st louis is for some reason shooting ap at me which i'm not going to totally complain about because if he was just shooting he and had had good hits on me he probably would have killed me as low as health as low of health as i am but we're going to keep putting shots down range using that amazing accuracy, starting fires, great fire chance on this thing. I did spec it with demo experts, so I'm starting fires really often, and bam, there's another kill. That's kill number three. Well, now we've got a problem, as you can see. We've got several full health ships in our cap, and we are being capped, and we are down a ship. We're having problems here, guys. So, Awaki Alpha, engage. To the rescue. We've got the DD, the Isakaze. He is smoking up in our cap. I need to get some resets on him. I need to make sure I reset as many of these ships as I can when I can. He's going to smoke up and disappear, and there he goes. So, I'm going to try to pepper where I saw him before. I did get a hit on him there. No defend because he hadn't earned any cap points again. But we're going to take a shot at these cruisers here now, too. They're, again, they're really freaking healthy. Really freaking healthy. And we've got a full health Wyoming coming in. And we are still down a ship, and we are down points. The Iwaki Alpha, not only does it have smoke, incredibly accurate guns, excellent fire chance, great damage on its shells. It also has the standard 59 knot 10 kilometer torpedoes. I didn't get a torpedo hit in this game, but just wanted to mention the fact that this son of a bitch has it. This, this ship has everything you would ever want. 
Now, I did switch to AP there because I thought he was going to stay broadside, but this guy was smart enough to bow into me. But just a quick switch over to HE as I'm trying to dodge his shots as best I can because I am very low health. I do get another fire on him, get a few more hits on him, get a few more hits. Come on, come on, come on, burn, baby, burn, 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 burn. You must burn. You must die. I want you to die. Why won't you die? Just die. Because I am very low health. I am very lonely. And I am fighting off a lot of ships. There's my fourth kill. My fourth kill in the Iwaki Alpha in defense of my cap. Well, this guy's just sitting there giving me a great shot. So, of course, I'm going to go ahead and lay some shots on him. Get those defenses out. Get those... Get, get them out of my cap. Get that defense going. Get the, save those cap points. We need to come back from this. We are still down a ship. And these guys are really freaking healthy. And we need to do something about it. I got this Isakazi Isik who's decided to come out of the cap for whatever reason. Which really, if he'd have just stayed in there and quiet, we would they would have won this game a long time ago. They would have won this game a long time ago, but he had, uh, I think he had a little CV fever there and decided to go after our CV. And uh, look at the accuracy. Kraken unleashed. Isakazi down. God, I love this ship. Oh, I wish I could have played this ship 100,000 times. Oh, uh, it was so good, so good, so good. Hey, Wargaming, if you ever watch this, how about you throw the Iwaki Alpha into like an incredibly rare chance super container? But we've got a nice broadside on this cruiser here, so what are we going to do? We're going to switch to AP. The Wyoming helps us out a lot and takes a good chunk of it. Look at the accuracy. Let's see. Boop! <laughs> Woo! Kill number six, and now it's two against one. Two against one. We're going to send out our 10-kilometer... Uh, 59 knot torpedoes at this Wyoming, but this Wyoming was playing incredibly cautious. Incredibly cautious. I'm at very low health. It's going to come down to the wire here, guys. We've got two healthy Wyomings and a almost dead Iwaki Alpha. So what's who's going to win this one? Well, you know, you know I'm going to win. You know, you know, you know. Mo like it, right? It's Mo like it. Dodging incoming fire from this Wyoming. I hit the border just trying to dodge. I can't believe I survived that salvo. I get a fire on the Wyoming and he makes a big mistake here. What does he do? He instantly repairs one fire. Battleship captains, let the fires burn, especially if you're getting spammed by an HE spamming cru cruiser. Don't repair that first fire. Not when you have full health. Not when you're that healthy. Because there's another fire, and you know what? He's going to wear that for the entire duration. He can't do anything about that. Ooh, there's my Confederate ribbon. As I'm just laying, I'm just trying to support and put out some damage as best I can while these battleships fight it out. I do not have the health to, to try to butt rush this Wyoming. And luckily, the other Wyoming has this guy's attention is the only reason I'm still alive. And I also wasn't spotted. But now as I get spotted again, I'm not feeling good about it. But I'm trying to dodge, trying to do, got another fire on him. And again, see, now is when he needed his repair. He's getting low health. He's got two fires burning on him. This is when he needed repair. I'm getting aimed at. I know it's coming. I know it's on its way. He's getting low health. I'm just trying to put as many shots into him as I can. Oh, oh God, he got me. He got me. But he's burning. He's burning. He's burning. Boop. <laughs> Woo, seven kills. 85,213 damage, guys. 184 hits. I even got a plane. Seven kills. 13 fires. Two citadels. Ended up with, uh, you know, five defense. I got a Kraken, Confederate, and a flesh wound. What a dumb ship. God, that ship is fun to play. Number one on the team, because that's Corgi Captain 51. <laughs> Oh, God, if, if they continue this, uh, 
this this uh, event in some form or another guys sign up for it sign up for it <clears throat> have some fun it is a blast you're helping out the community you're having you're having some fun and you get to play any ship that you don't have any ship you don't have I enjoyed playing the Roma, the Ashitaka. I even played the HSF Graf Spree and stuff. Just whatever ship I didn't have. Fun stuff, guys. But as always, thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Doing that giveaway at 250 subscribers, I am really close. We need like four or five more people to smash that sub button, and I'm going to give prizes to you. If you didn't kill a Corgi, you didn't get any prizes, here's your chance get some prizes. Nothing but love from Mo to you. Take care of yourselves. Take care of your others. We'll see you out there in the seas, kids, and we will talk to you soon.